Shake that. Shake that. Every day I'm shuffling. Hey everyone, Megan here with AMI Clubwear. And you guys have been requesting a video for quite some time now. And a lot of you have requested to see me shuffling and or teaching how to shuffle. So I'm gonna show you guys how to shuffle to the best of my abilities. I am not a professional, nor do I think that I'm actually really that good at shuffling. Um, all that I have done is watch tutorials on YouTube, just like you guys are doing right now on how to shuffle. And I'm still trying to get it down. I'm still trying to perfect it. So I'm gonna show you the best that I can on what I know for shuffling. Um, but first I wanna tell you guys a little bit more about shuffling. You guys probably have seen shuffling through LMFAO's music videos or songs. Okay, so the shuffle that I'm gonna show you guys today is the Melbourne Shuffle and it's one of the most popular shuffles. There's also the hard style and jump style shuffles that you guys can YouTube and kinda of learn how to get variations off of your shuffles. Um, there are six, generally about six different steps to the Melbourne Shuffle and that is the Running Man, T-Shuffle, Kicks, Spin Kicks, The Glide, and Extreme Spins. Alright, so let's get shuffling. Every day I'm shuffling. So the first move of the shuffle is the Running Man. Basically all you're going to do is start off with your right foot in a flamingo position and then with your right foot step forward while sliding your left foot back. Next, take your left foot and bring it up to flamingo position while sliding the right foot to the center. This should look like the starting position but on the opposite foot. Now step forward with the left foot while sliding the right foot back. Now just repeat the steps. When you're doing the running man, you generally want to stay in one place. So a really good tip to learning how to do the running man is to do these steps really, really slowly until you get the hang of it and then gradually speed them up until you finally can do it up to speed. But make sure when you're doing the shuffle, do stuff with your arms. Don't, because this is not good. It looks weird like you're concentrating on your legs. No. You want to do something like this, because you are running. Point. Whatever you want. Just make sure you're moving your whole body, you feel the music, and you're into it. The next move is the T-step or T-shuffle. Put all your weight on the left foot and raise the right foot to the flamingo position. Stomp your right foot down while turning your left heel in to make an L, a T, or a V shape. Raise your right foot back up while turning your left foot so that it's facing straight again. You should now be in the starting position. When you pivot, you should be traveling slightly to one side or the other. Now just repeat the steps as you travel to one side. Alright, let's kick it y'all. Third step is kicks. Similar to the T-shuffle, but instead you're going to kick your foot outwards instead of down. Now I'm going to show you how to do spin kicks. Spin kicks are super, super easy, probably the easiest step of the shuffle, and all you're doing is kicking down while you're pivoting in a circle. This motion is generally done in a circle backwards. Put all your weight on the right foot while the other leg is raised. When you kick down, twist your right foot counterclockwise to move in a circle backwards. Each time you twist, kick your left foot down. This can be done on either foot, just pick whatever foot is comfortable for you. Next is the glide. This is the hardest, most advanced move of the shuffle. I still haven't quite perfected this move, so I'm going to try to the best of my ability to show you how it goes. Start with the running man, and when you come to a flamingo position, kick your flamingo leg out away from you, and then slide the other foot towards it. Then raise this foot to flamingo position, and begin the running man. Repeat these steps and glide in different directions, i.e. circles, squares, pentagon, tetrahedrons, whatever tickles your fancy. Last but not least is the 360 spin. This is by far the easiest move of the shuffle. All you're doing is spinning in a circle on one foot and when you come around to finish off your 360, you're gonna do a small jump at the end. All 
Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Let me know what you guys think. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Have fun shuffling. Bye. Every day I'm shuffling.